I was thinking about what I could possibly do in this subway station, I titled this project Walking on Sunshine. For me, it was an opportunity to bring a little bit of sunshine down into a dismal subway station. My goal was to create a large-scale drawing that people could walk on that would feel like they were walking on a collage. And I didn't know, honestly, if I was going to be able to accomplish that. It brought art and color and light into the space, um, changed the aesthetics of the space. I love the abstraction that was done. It's really different and the colors that were used. It's kind of really exposed me to how uh, integrated a lot of art is these days and the fact that even though I'm studying photography, I don't have to limit myself to that. Well, my students have heard about this process now, the joys and the frustrations for a long period of time. I think when they finally were able to come here today to see that it did materialize, that it did work out, I'm hoping that they can bring back that to the studio in their own work and just to see literally it is that kind of persistence that it takes for us to make things happen. I think it's really incredible you get exposure to the process not only from the painting end but what's involved in working with a public institution like SEPTA. What I learned is that you have to have an incredible amount of patience, that you have to have the fortitude to stick with it throughout all the various pitfalls that are along the way. It was pretty exciting to uh, be able to have a hand in uh, something that I knew everybody was going to be able to see when they came through the station. I was really kind of elated at the opportunity. It inspires me. It's really a great piece and I'm very proud to be a student of hers. It's uh, an absolute treasure and the public is uh, fortunate to have it.